Hi. Um, well, so this video is another one about products. Like I know I said that I don't really use products, but I'm not really a product junkie. Well, I wasn't when I was transitioning. And obviously it's too soon for me to say now that like, I'm um, completely natural because it's only been a few days. But I went shopping today and I found a few items because I know a lot of people use curl activator and all that kind of stuff. But with me, because my hair is pretty curly already and on the whole, generally, it doesn't tend to frizz too much. I think just maybe along the front where the hair is more coarse, the front and the sides. Um, the middle is very, very curly and soft, but the front and the front sides are a bit more coarse than the rest of the hair. Um, I, I thought that, you know, maybe I would see what difference, you know, curl activator makes. Um, so I found a new product it's called, well, it's not new, but it's new to me. I've never heard of it before. It's called Urban Therapy Twisted Sister. And this is the Curl Activator Cream Moisturizer. It's meant to activate curls and eliminate frizz. Hold on, let me just zoom in there so that you can see it. Um, so it puts life back into tired, saggy curls, delivering volume, bounce, and curl definition to naturally curly, afro, or permed hair. Um, so I will use it probably tomorrow when I'm when I like wet my hair like before I go out. Then I also bought the serum, the anti frizz serum. This is also by Urban Therapy Twisted Sister. Um, instantly eliminates frizz for both straight and curly hairstyles. So I'll let you know how I get along with that. And then keeping in line with these products I found this as well um, urban twisted sister 30 second curl spray um, so this is also meant to re revitalize curls um, so I will see like I'll, I'll have a like I'll use all these products I'll probably use them obviously more than once unless they're really really awful just to get a feel of you know the kind of effect they're gonna have on my hair then I found another um, anti-frizz serum. This is pure coconut and it's by Inecto, Necto, paraben free. Um, I don't know how many people know, but propyl, paraben, methyl, paraben, anything with paraben in it, um, I just try to avoid. Um, so yeah, this is just meant to add softness and shine. And you put a bit of this on wet hair. Um, obviously I won't use all the products together, I'll try them one by one, so this will probably be later on in the week or next week, I'll try it. Then in terms of conditioner, um, I haven't actually run out of pink oil yet, but I was just thinking that maybe I should, you know, try something else that is not necessarily more specifically like for natural hair, but just, you know, have a good, try something else out. I'm not going to know if I just stick to one product, you know, my hair could be different with other products. So I bought this Gumtree henna hair conditioner um, enriched with natural henna extract so um, I was I didn't actually smell it normally I smell stuff like this in the shop before I buy it mmm it smells really good you can't really see it it's like a pale green color I can't describe the smell but it smells really really nice so if the effects you know if I do like the effects then just based on the smell I think I'll stick to it it's 500 milligrams and it was only like one pound so it was really really cheap so I'll probably use it for my co-wash um, tomorrow or tonight depending on what I do I should also quickly talk about um, what I did to my hair today I did twists last night like mini twists with my hair believe it or not it's actually long enough to do that it's pretty long you know it's it's long enough to do all that kind of stuff as you can see well, not well, I say pretty long, that makes it sound like it's short length. What I mean is that it's long enough to do twists and flats. I didn't think it was, but it is. It was just um, because it was so curly and because of the shrinkage I didn't realise before. So I twisted it last night and um, yeah, like I like the way it came out. It stretched the curls just a teeny weeny itsy bit, not a load, like not loads, but enough for me to... I left four twists in at the front and I pinned them down as if, you know, I'd done flat twists basically. I don't know if you can see that. Um, yeah, so I pinned them down and um, yeah, I'll, I did it on dry hair though. I used leave-in conditioner, but I did it on dry hair. So I think with the next 
um, next, I'll do try and do a twist out tonight if I'm not too tired, like if I can be bothered. And I will like, put, I'll make a video about you know the results and I'll try out some of the products as well, like I said. Um, so yeah, that's it for now. <laughs>